whenever it comes to the iconic uh, laid back country picker picture that's on all the t-shirts and the bumper stickers and all of that how did that come to fruition did you plan that out or is that like just a picture that somebody took and what just how did that become your go-to symbol almost well everything you said it's a little bit of all of that picture is probably 10 years old would you say Teresa? i don't know we was it was 2007 is that right? When we, when we went out. We were, we were just touring around out west with a friend of mine named Rob McNerlin. We were playing a backup band for him, and Luna was doing some song, uh, set. And, you know, there was no laid back at this point. I was just playing guitar. And we were in Niederwall, Texas, on the 4th of July one night, and we were very tired. And we'd played a show, and we were outside, and people were shooting fireworks, and it was just insane. And Teresa was just taking some pictures, and she took that picture of me that night. It's such a cool picture. I thought, well, that'd be a great picture to have on a shirt, maybe. Just wear it. No explanation. Just that picture. But I never put it on a shirt until many years later, and my daughter talked me into it. We went to an ice cream place that had a sign-up that said, we'll make any shirt for 25 bucks." So I gave them that picture, and they put it on a shirt, and it looked awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And I sported around a little bit, and I showed it to, we were getting ready to play a show opening up for Tyler. Were we opening for Tyler? Well, we were one of the bands. Yeah, at Wattsburg. And, I mean, this is back before Tyler had blown up. And Tyler saw it, and he said, well, that's a great shirt. I'd wear that. So I got Tyler one of them, and he started wearing it, and it just started that little underground movement. And people started contacting me saying, I'd like to buy that shirt, and it just took off and become the little hip underground secret to know that if, if you're wearing that shirt, you're in the in crowd. So. 